last card that I have to share with you is from this is craft paper and they are pre-made cards so I bought they come with the envelopes and um, what I did to this one this is a uh, Stampendous I think it's Stampendous but this is the older stamp set that I really liked from last year that Rosanna used and she found it when she went she found it for me and it's this jumbo Stampendous so the snowflakes that you see on the side, this is what I did on the border. And then I, I fussy cut those when I stamped them. And it's clear embossed onto the straight onto the craft paper. And I really, really like how that looks. It just, I don't know, it looks rustic, but it kind of, it shines. So I, I really like it. So it's clear embossing onto that. And I also clear embossed the word joy onto some craft paper from Recollections. And I doodled with metallic pens and then added stickles to the edge of my fussy cutting. And I use some of the little tiny snowflakes that come with the Kane Company set that I showed you in the snowflake one. And then the way I worked on those snowmen, let me see if I can use the light properly here. I don't know if I can show you the texture on it. Can you see that? So that one is done with snow text. And all of the details are done with, the hat is stickles and liquid pearls with um, white and blue stickles. The nose is liquid pearls in orange and so are the eyes and the mouth. And then the scars are done in stickles and liquid pearls. So I don't know if you can see the, the glittery effect mixed with the liquid pearls. It's kind of interesting. And that's, that's the outside of that one. And then the inside looks like this. I used yellow Recollections paper cardstock for the background, and then the craft one from Recollections, then a scrap of paper in like very pale blue that I thought went really well with the colors that I had used in the front, and another layer of craft. And then I also embossed, clear embossed that the word peace. Did my doodling again with stickles on the border, added the last snowflake that I had from that set, and then that little doily flower. It so this is the stamp set that I used. And I have something, no, I just tore it. It's some Kaiser Craft. And in the name of it, it's Christmas Sentiments. So I used the joy and the peace on that one. The doily comes from this. Recollections um, doily said that Nicole had sent me in a swap. So thank you, girl. It was perfect. I was looking for something small to complement that little um, sentiment and not too bulky. And I wanted to bring the blue inside and yay. <laughs> and then for the center of it, I want something that was not too raised either, but it added some a little touch. And I used one of the bling brads that Steph had sent me in a swap that, in a swap that we made. So thank you, Steph. And then what I did to the envelope was I, I also clear embossed it. So I did that at the bottom of the envelope here. And then I did the flap on the back with a, the same jumbo stamp. So that's this set here. And that's it. I'm using this one that I already started coloring. And I have an idea of what I want to do with this one. So that's why I already started working on that one. And that one's from this. And she's called Fly Above It All. I love the gorgeous girls. Um, I have that one to work with, and I have these two that I think are, like, the last few of the, like, holiday Christmas ones that Steph had sent. So um, I have these two that I still want to play with this year. I don't want to um, hide them away and save them for next year. I want to be able to share them with someone by making a project with them. So that's my next challenge, to use those three into cards that I create or... Um, I don't know, some other type of idea that I come up with that you, that um, I can use those for. So thanks so much for your visits, hugs and kisses, everyone. And um, thanks for keeping me company while I do this. I'm loving um, to the, finding the comments and seeing that you're liking it and that um, it's inspiring you. So thanks for letting me know and see you very soon.